quickly. Once he's got the signal. Muradam, he's going to get us underway. There's obviously a stickle of a time. We're finally here with it because they're so capable of doing that. And that was given away. And Eto did it, but actually it was a late inclusion in the score. That's a good throw, and this is a Boma! But West did well to get across. Finds its way through here. Desperate piece of defending from Raymond Caller. Eventually the free kick goes Cameroon's way. And Chukwu looks at him on in the semi. Might well figure in this final. That's a chance for Jeremy to cross here. And then Boma was... Nigerian right. Little ball dinged forward from Adepoju. Trying to find that's Jeremy's cross looking for Mboma. But done well to head it back across to Eto. Poor so far by Nigeria. They've not been able to keep the hold of the ball at all. And uh, what can Jeremy do from this corner? It's a cop shot. And just blazed it across the face of goal. He had no support. And Jeremy's corner looked to be a little over hit there. And it proved that it was. Now, no real pattern there to the two corners. We've seen what? Heading towards goal. Lovely languid piece of skill there from Carnu. Well, he thought he'd been brought down. Well, oh. here's Akocha. And Akocha tries something. But way off target. Just position Alembe. Was making a move down the left-hand side, but in the end it was swung in by Wome. And fairly easy for Fury one on that occasion. Played in towards Mboma. Up to Mboma. Well, Maya was in space down the left. Well, the referee spotted a foul there. Well, that's a definite foul on Mboma. They swung in. They just need to alter the post! And Cameroon have the opening they wanted! And it's Samuel Eto who can prom Sutton down the touchline. Wome's ball in. And the silence in Lagos. Eto gives Cameroon the lead. And now Nigeria will really have to come out. And it was you again. Well, complaints there from Chukwu that may over might be through here. Chance for Mboma on the left front. But unbelievably, Sharon has made a blunder of the highest order. In the most important game of football in his life, Ike Sharon Let's the ball through his legs and Boma has his fourth goal. He's capable of coming back from this. It is Nigeria if they have. The spells they're capable of having and the foul there on. Well, Alium got to his right and probably had it covered, but Elise unleashed. Jeremy can't dig the cross out though. And uh, all a little bit disappointing in the end. Cameron are not shy and throwing bodies forward. Because the space is Laurel Meyer. And Meyer can advance and continue to advance. But a goal kick, it would have been a brave, brave referee to give a penalty there. Babayado. And it's going to drop here to a cop shot. And would you believe straight at the goalkeeper, a yard either side, it was 2 1. And now Cardo with the elastic legs. And danger inside the penalty area, but well dealt with by Kala and good refereeing. They have left themselves a little open. This is Wome. That's a good ball in as well. And rebounds off the upright. Still a chance here for Cameroon. And there. And Chukwu is challenging. Unnecessary flamboyant clearance, but... And from Mboma and Sharuna is covered. It's a chance for Eto to make it free. And it's spanned. And again, Nigeria cling on. Comeback being required. A lovely turn to Akocha. Worried about his near post. The ball in from Finidi, but... Mkana's done well. That's Chukwu! A 
and Nigeria have the goal back just before half time and how important could that be suddenly Lagos can smile again brilliant skill from Kanu an accomplished finish from Chukwu Nigeria are right back in the final well it's a game wide open Chukwu's done very very well there got the ball out of his feet Cameroon a look a bit rickety well there's the half time whistle from Murat Dami and what a half cage and so Julius Agaha on to Raphael Chukwu and uh, if Chukwu didn't have an injury, half time, suddenly there's a bit of space here for Alembe. Wriggled away from Fanidi. And for the first time was able to use his pace. And can Cameroon defend for this second half? Oh, what a strike! What an unbelievable goal from JJ Akocha! And so, parity is restored. Lagos goes berserk. JJ Akocha has driven Nigeria right back into the African Nations Cup final. What an absolutely fabulous shot there. Akocha could not have hit that better. It was almost going to prevail here. This is Eto for Cameroon. And Sharungo was struggling again and nearly dropped it at the feet of Mboma. This is Jeremy. Fairly easy clearance there for Ian Amy. Well now a little bit of space opening up here and what a chance that is! And Sharon Moon nearly beaten at his near post. The Nigerian defence just went AWOL there to allow Eto in. You know, Elise and Jeremy getting involved there. Let's have another look. That's the last thing this game needs is uh, hope. Well, Elise says with everything we were hoping it would be. The ball from Jeremy. And I suppose uh, anything says she wouldn't move. Well now a little bit of space and driven straight at Alioum with Kanu closing in. A great ball forward here to Laurent Meyer. And Laurent nearly picking out Eto. And so, and now Laura Meyer again. And Tarano West just stood in his way. And now Kanu. Well, Kanu got to the byline, but there was absolutely no one attacking. Maybe we'll get the service now from Meyer. Well, he whipped in towards the back post, towards Ferry. That was fairly deliberate. I think he was trying to head it back across goal. Maya brought down again by Barriero. Well played in again by Jeremy and what a dangerous ball and Boma and Eto couldn't get on the end of it. Well Callow's rising with Ali Umsai to get in the way he played in the semi. He's going to do well to get around Callow, but he's drawn three of the Cameroon defenders towards him. And won the oh, it's very static there. Never looked a real threat to the Cameroon defence. Well, Murad Dami. Forward there from Baba Yara for Agahara. It's a run up against Wome and Alembe. Ivanagin has got the same problem as Benidi. Now on Boma! He's also got star quality, which arguably in today's game is a little more important. You see that Agaho has been tightly marshaled there. Well, Kanu audaciously tried to... Well, Agaho is very willing. And Ali off. And Baliara battling away and eventually winning. It's forward from Song. With the flag up for offside against Joel. Well, almost all went through to Meyer. And Ferre. Jeremy nearly picked out Mboma there. And that wasn't a million miles away either. Driven back in and 
Yeah, keeping the ball in the opposition half as well. Definitely got pulled away. Maybe Cameroon have a chance to finish it here. Back to an offside position. Didn't allow Jeremy Tain to get the cross in. And there is the final whistle from Murad Dami. Well, I don't think it'll be much between the two. I think they both really do want this. It's going to be Patrick and Boma. And that was a pretty good lead by Sharon Mitt. Fairly confident. Certainly worth a go from there. Gida had done it again. Still danger though. Babangida's corner. And that was ambitious. And that was you. A little bit of cramp. And there Babangida. No, appeals for handball, but you know, lucky to have that given. Haro. It's going to be Elise. And it was always rising from the moment he hit it. Saying his options, he's done brilliantly. Babangida! Great save, Aliou! Maybe his position wasn't put. Babangida in space. It's not a bad cross either from Babangida! And it wasn't far wide. I think Aliou had given up on it from McFaber. Ball forward from Mitomo. That's Jeremy's cross. And that's Shirunmu's throw. That's the end of the first period of extra time. Various turn to get us underway. And Kanu, she's looking dangerous here. And Jeremy's gone down. But still, this is Mboba. Who nearly got through. Maya still might. Penalty area. Try and continue the threat. Well, Job's got plenty of energy and he's still going. And he's got support. a break here I'm not sure he's got the leg though and it's Baba Yaga oh he's done well there's a cut inside but there's a rather crude foul Carnu Amy oh he's done well to play and Boma he can and Boma win it no just didn't quite have the strength Well, it's going to go to penalties, the 22nd Nations Cup. No one's managed to win it in 120 minutes of football. And first up, it is Nigeria. And that's really well tucked away. Excellent penalty again. Shirunmu going the right way. So now what can Alium do? Well that's driven in with some power. So it's Wome against Sharunmu. Oh excellently tucked away by Wome. Now Wome was out somewhere, we'll see. Kano against Alium. And Alium saved it! First blood to Cameroon in the penalty shooter. Get Nigeria back into it. This is Jeremy. And driven by Jeremy. 3-2. And Aliyum waits again. Now, did it go over the line? I rather think it did, but... And for Cameroon, oh and he's missed! Would you believe he's missed the target? Well now it's 3 all. Team land here. Song against Shirumbo, and he's done it! And Cameroon have won the African Nations Cup, albeit in controversial circumstances. Rigobert Song 